got here about 7.30 this morning. Got the trucks unloaded and uh, shot some bows for a while. And the outfitter took us out now. And uh, the way it works here, we are on Wawang Lake Resort. And uh, they got a series of baits set up. And you just pick a bait and you have to go hang your own stand. So I got up in this tree here finally and everything's set. I actually set up on the other side originally where the outfitter told me to but the wind has kind of switched and it's coming it was blowing right at the bait so I tore my stand out and moved it over here um, I mean kind of a little bit of an awkward tree but the wind right so um, hopefully some bears show up tonight we got a bait down here with some molasses and some stale bread um, it's a real quiet it's sunny it's a beautiful afternoon it's only um, it's 2.30 right now, so we still got another almost seven hours today, so hopefully something shows up tonight. The rest of the guys are on down the road quite a ways. Um, they're going to come pick me up after dark on their way back through, so um, super excited. It's my first night in a bear woods ever, so we'll see what happens. Looking forward to it. Sarah, tell us what you're doing. Making a sign so the other truck stops to know to help us. Why do they need to stop to help us? Because I hit a bear. Here too. Yeah. Yeah. This is going for reflective tags. Right here. Yes. We backtrack. Oh, look at this. Think look at this. The things ahead. Look at this. He, you see those branches right here? Yeah. Those leaves? Yeah, they're smashed. Tracks sometimes? Yeah. Blood trails for anything is hard to track mm -hmm. sometimes. Yeah, that's fair. Pete, yeah. over here. I got it. White stuff good for a nine. There he is! There he is! Oh! 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 Look at that 
that, Benny? There you go. Oh my God. You. <laughs> wow. Yeah, Great baby. Job.
he laid down. I don't know if I got him on film or not. He laid down at this first tree. And he was licking all the molasses off of it. And the wind swirled one time and he picked his head up like he was gonna leave. And I said, screw it, I was, I was gonna wait for him to get to the bait. So I had more of a broadside shot. It was shooting pretty straight down. He's at like, he's at like four yards. I mean, he's like right below me. But he acted like he was gonna leave. And I said, no way, I'm gonna get a shot. So. I drilled him. He, he went down right there. I could see him. He did a real long death moan. And he's done. He didn't go 40 yards. <gasps> Finally. Cow. I'm pumped. 10.45. Zero. What? When he came in first, he, was, he laid down. Oh. But he was laying down like right here, just his head was licking, there was a pool of molasses right here. Yeah. So all this stuff was in my way. Yeah. Then he stood up and put his paws like right here. And they got him out of here. And then he looked over and he laid back down, but he laid like right on top of this. No, he laid maybe back. Yeah, he laid he laid back. He laid here. back down here. Yeah. He moved up and it, it cleared these branches. My arrow is actually Yeah, it's sticking. It yeah. It deflected, because yeah. it'd have been more like this. Yeah. 